Hey there, we're back with more sweet treats to put all those apples you've been picking over the weekend to good use. Justin Chappell is the host of Food & Wine's Mad Genius Tips. Welcome back, buddy. Thank you. Okay, so you're going to launch in with something else? Yes, so we are making the easiest applesauce of your life. Oh. We're going to make it in the slow cooker. I okay, so Christian loves here's, cooking. Oh, I love to dump Here, I'll let you dump yeah, that in. There's fun. four or six apples, whatever you want. Peel them, chop them. Okay. okay. You also have some cinnamon, some nutmeg, some you salt. Put that all right. that in there? Throw that right okay, in there with a little good. lemon juice. Oh, lemon Can juice. Can I just tell you how much and the slow water. cooker changes life? I oh, just it's amazing. It's totally Thank goodness for a slow cooker. Here you go. Yep. You top it. You cook it on high four to six hours and you end up with these incredibly soft mm. apples that who wants this? to mash I, can I is that hot? Oh, you no it's good it's good yeah. but that's not wow. even the best part you get to mash it so no, go ahead and take really? a little potato mash it on my, nice with my feet i'd love to eat okay <laughs> no, all right, fine. it's like stomping grapes <laughs> smash yeah. it up yeah. the and Lucy. it's great because you can eat this warm if oh, you yep. like or you could uh wow. pop it in the refrigerator eat it oh. nice and cold now see that you put in your kids lunch box <laughs> yes put a, they open that at lunch you're just king you get to barter anything and it's totally it's it. leverage. So now we're making Hasselback apples. A lot of people have heard of Hasselback potatoes, yes. but apples is going to be your new favorite dessert. Okay. Okay. So we've cut an apple in half and cored it, and you see we put a chopstick on both sides. Hmm. And what you do is you use the chopstick just to keep, prevent you from cutting all, all the way, way through, through the apple. Oh, that's a great interesting. hack. Yeah. And you go all the way down and pop yeah. them in a baking sheet just like this. Excellent okay. hack. <laughs> and then what you do is you mix a little butter with some brown sugar, cinnamon, salt. Awesome. Just like that. You want to mm. give that a whisk? Ingredients. Yummy, And yum. then when you get that nice and mixed, you spoon it on top, bake it at 350 until it's really soft, like here. Yep. Serve it with ice cream, and this is like the best fall dessert, oh, right? Oh, yeah. I love it. So to explain, yeah, hack, mm. did, did you know what a cooking hack is? Uh, of course I do, <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's a shortcut. It's, it's a an shortcut. easier like way it's of doing direct, something. Yeah. Yes, well, but you've... the best part is we make it a lot of fun. See? Oh, so these no, are without fun. question, I have enjoyed every moment <laughs> And of there this. you have it. Justin, mm. thank you so much. How's the taste? Mm. Uh, it's great. It's great. All right, we're back in a moment. This is Today on NBC. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.